Now, crime is on the rise in Shreveport, and tonight, Police Chief Ben Raymond explains why. NBC 6's Zyneria Bird sat down with Chief Raymond this afternoon, and she joins us now live, sharing more on their conversation. Zyne, good evening. Good evening, Dan. Chief Raymond says the increase in crime is happening for many reasons, ranging from the pandemic to gains in the city. Shreveport Police Chief Ben Raymond says there has been a substantial increase of homicides this year. 2017 at this time we had I believe 53 homicides. In 2018 at this time of year we had 52. Uh, this year we have 63. So it's an increase and I'm not trying to compare to those years as, as you know you should be proud of what we're doing. Um, but I don't think it's such an anomaly um, that, that a lot of people perceive because last year's numbers were so low. Chief Raymond says the increase in homicides are for a number of reasons, one being COVID. Even though crime went down at the start of the pandemic, the crime shot up in August. People who are out of jobs, uh, they had loss of income, that creates stress uh, on individuals, it creates stress within families, and generally people that are stressed are more prone to acting out or making decisions that, that, that they were otherwise probably would not make. And over the summer, the nation shined a spotlight on police. You've also had some, some negative or some anti-law enforcement sentiment this, this year. You've had some national use of force incidents. You've had some local use of force incidents. Uh, I think that's contributing to our um, recruitment problems. Chief Raymond says they had more officers on the force last year. Right now the department has 488 officers, but they are allocated 580 officers. I, I think if it, if it lasts for long, it's going to um, it's going to possibly cause some increases simply because we're not able to conduct investigations as thoroughly as we'd like. We're not able to respond as quickly to calls. One of their initiatives for preventing crime is the Violent Crimes Task Force. They focus on individuals who they believe will be suspects or victims in a violent crime based on previous criminal activity and relationships. What you may label as a gang, what you may label as a criminal organization, uh, you may just call it a group of friends, but whatever you call it, um, there are definitely some, some groups that are feuding with one another in some of our neighborhoods, and that contributes to violence. Chief Raymond says the ultimate weapon against crime is the community. Uh, we are getting a lot of Crime Stoppers tips, which, which means the community is involved, and that's great. Um, but everybody's still not doing their part. There's still people out there who um, think that because they're not the ones committing the crime that they're not responsible. And Chief Ryman says the solution to lowering the numbers is not just on the backs of police, but also community members. Reporting live in Shreveport, I'm Zanir Yerbird, NBC 6 News. All right, Zanir, thank you so much. Well, the mayor of